Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Clancy with 1013 Vintage, where we talk about quality thrift, thrifting, and everything fancy. And I want to show you a little hack that I've been trying to do with a lot of the coats that I've been thrifting. I actually got commented on a vest that I was wearing the other day, and I explained to the woman that I actually thrifted the coat for like $10. And because the arms were so large, I cut them off. And I didn't do any kind of sewing, which I'll show you shortly. I did not, I did not do any kind of sewing. <laughs> I gotta just wear like, that's the look now. That, that whole distressed, uh, raggedy, ripped up clothes, dirty kind of vibe. And I was trying to, I was trying to add on to it. So this is the coat. And I wish I would have videoed. How come I don't never video when in the moment? I have to work on videoing in the moment, which I believe is semi-vlogging. So I will try to do that. But this was the coat that I found. It's authentic fur. And you can see how it's kind of like has like different lines. It's like lined. This is what I liked about the coat, right? But the arms were so huge. They were huge. They were just like, you know, that 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 vintage coat style where they had the, like the big balloon sleeves that just wasn't giving. But it had a um it had a uh, a, a large uh, shoulder pad in print. So what I did was I just cut the coat. I cut the sleeves and you can see Okay, I'm sorry, it looks kind of shanky, but you guys will get the point. Look, I just cut it. I didn't put, I didn't do anything else to it but cut it. I just cut the sleeves. Look at it. See, I just cut, I just, I just cut all of this. And this left like a, it left like an arched shoulder pad. Like a, I don't know if you can really see it, but. Let me show you how it looks on. Now, I'm gonna try it on, but I really think if I had on, oh, let me go get a sweatshirt. Okay. Okay, you see the, you see it? Do you see the vision? So I like that I have like, you have to have on like a sweatshirt or something thicker underneath, but see how it's like, I mean, you could see, what is that? I wear this sweatshirt so much. Is this a hole? Y'all, it's a hole. Wait a minute. What is that? Oh. I wear this sweatshirt so much. It's a freaking hole. Mm. Oh, well. Look at this right here. See how I cut that? You can't really. I got to tuck it. But normally, like, when I'm out, you can't see. It. Maybe I can pin it right here. But for the most part, look at this. This is, and this is fur, but this is, I think this is what, when people see it, I think this is the part that attracts them to it because they're like, where does she get that coat? I just cut the shoulders. I just cut the shoulders. I was trying to make a vest, which I needed to cut this right here. This right here would have given me more of the vest look, but when I cut it here, it gave me like that Star Trek vibe, right? What do you guys think? Do you like it this way? Or do you think I should go full strength with the, with the, um, to cut the rest to make it more of the vest? Because if I, if I wanted to just do like a vest look, you can just cut it right here. Yeah, yeah, look at this with my hood and I just need a nice hat and some boots. Yeah, so that's a hack. If you guys are thrifting, look for old furs that you can rework, whether you can take the sleeves off, make it more of a vest because more so you wanna make sure the fur is in good, in good, um, in good condition. There's no holes, there's no tears. Um, 
And yeah, look at that. So if you enjoyed this video, click like, share, tell a friend. I love showing you guys stuff like this. So <laughs> let me know if you enjoyed these videos in the comments. And until then, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.